गुड इवनिंग गुड इवनिंग एवरीवन नो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल टू बिगिन विद बायो केमिस्ट्री पार्ट गाइस द साउंड इज कंप्लीटली परफेक्ट फ्रॉम माय एंड गाइस प्लीज increase the sound from your end everything is perfect from my end here everything is perfect from my end i don't have any issues here hello हेलो परफेक्ट कमॉन सो नाउ एवरीथिंग इज परफेक्ट लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड विद द क्लास राइट नाउ गाइस नॉट टू बिगिन विद द बायो केमिस्ट्री क्लास एज आई टोल्ड यू के वी विल बी गोइंग डूइंग द बायो केमिस्ट्री क्लास लाइक इन फोर डेज हियर राइट नाउ टुडे टुमारो एंड Like another four days, we'll be completing the entire biochemistry class. And the biochemistry class will be mostly from 6 p.m. in the evening, and then up to 11 o'clock in the night. Okay, we'll be doing again the same thing, guys, in two sessions. The first session will be like somewhere around two and a half hours to three hours, and another session is like two and a half hours to three hours. So somewhere around, uh, we'll be doing it for you know um, five to six hours per day. Fine. So that will be completing our biochemistry part, guys. Okay. Yes, I forgot to say happy holy to all of you. सो नाउ कीप ऑन राइटिंग द नोट्स अलॉन्ग विथ मी गाइस मेरे साथ साथ में ना नोट्स भी लिखिए कीप ऑन राइटिंग द नोट्स अलॉन्ग विथ मी राइट नाउ कम ऑन स्टार्ट राइटिंग गाइस सो नाउ माय डियर फ्रेंड्स फर्स्ट थिंग द फर्स्ट टॉपिक दैट वी आर गोइंग टू बिगिन विद द कार्बोहाइड्रेट मेटाबॉलिज्म सर द फर्स्ट टॉपिक दैट वी आर गोइंग टू बिगिन इन बायो केमिस्ट्री विल बी कार्बोहाइड्रेट मेटाबॉलिज्म now <clears throat> now the same thing guys every time you know i'll be starting uh, from the very basics so let me start from the very basics the starting 1 to 2 hours will be at most important guys kyunki main aapko na sare basics padhaunga i'll be teaching all the basics for the part now first to begin with imagine that you know this will be your esophagus here and the stomach here right now guys and for example if you are consuming the carbohydrate rich diet the diet which is rich in carbohydrate carbohydrate rich diet okay <clears throat> bharat a voice is very clear everything is very clear from my side i don't have any issues here volume is maximum everything is max here right now i don't have any issues from my side you people just try to increase from your side now for example we are consuming carbohydrate rich diet nowadays everyone knows guys carbohydrates are present in the you know the rice chapati the bread whatever you consume that will have carbohydrates in that so we are going to begin from this point so please try to learn it perfectly right now so we are going to consume the carbohydrate rich diet and today what we'll see ke sabse pehle kya hoga what is going to happen it's going to get digested sabse pehle kya hoga sir digestion hoga Now we all know digestion means nothing but the breakdown of the larger molecules into simple molecules. Breakdown of larger molecules into simple molecules. What about the other people? Like, is everyone uh, facing a problem with the audio? Is audio perfect for everyone? Yeah, most of the people are clear with audio, right? <clears throat> Perfect. Then we'll go ahead. The other people try to see from your side. Okay, what is the problem? Let's begin with the class right now. Okay. Now, now I'm going to con consume the carbohydrate-rich diet. Okay. And now do one thing. First thing is that.
now the first thing that we are going to do right now is that okay now whatever whatever carbohydrates that you are consuming whatever carbohydrates that you are consuming sabse pehle kya and digestion means breakdown of the larger molecules into simple molecules hai na so today we will do one thing we'll make a list of all the carbohydrates that we are going to consume so what are the carbohydrates that we are consuming on day to day basis whatever vegetable fruits and everything that you are consuming will be having maltose in that and the sweet substances that you consume that will have sucrose in that and the milk and milk products that you are consuming that will have lactose in that so if you see in our day to day life what are the carbohydrates that we are consuming the carbohydrates that we are consuming will be the maltose which is present in the you know the vegetable fruits and everything the sucrose that is sugar wala part sweet sweet part and the lactose lactose will be present in the milk and milk products and now this is the carbohydrate that we are consuming on day to day basis chaliye sir digestion karte hain remember maltose will get digested to form two molecules of glucose glucose and glucose sucrose will get digested to form molecule of glucose along with the molecule of fructose and then lactose lactose will break down to form a molecule of glucose along with the molecule of galactose okay so maltose will break down to form two molecules of glucose sucrose will break down to form two mole- molecules of glucose and fructose and then lactose will break down to form molecule of glucose and galactose and maltose is going to break down the presence of maltase sucrose in the presence of sucrase and lactose will all know that hain and by this we complete digestion of all the carbohydrates that we are consuming on daily basis on the daily basis we are consuming these carbohydrates and they are digested and i think i don't have to tell you again and again ke please in my class keep on st- Uh, studying or i mean to say keep on learning while writing guys so the moment you write something please keep on learning that maltose is going to break down to form two molecules of glucose and sucrose will break down to form a molecule of glucose and fructose and lactose will break down to form a molecule of glucose and galactose and now by this we can clearly see here what is the end product of digestion of carbohydrates the carbohydrates are digested to form large molecules of glucose with a little bit of fructose and galactose guys wow Okay, so there itself you write down the end product of digestion of carbohydrates. So what are the end products of digestion of carbohydrates? From today onwards, don't think only glucose. You have got glucose and even fructose and even galactose. So that is the first thing that we are learning today. so end product of digestion of carbohydrates will be both uh, all the three parts uh, all three things that is your glucose fructose and galactose chaliye sir digestion ho gaya now after digestion what is the next thing that will be happening happening guys absorption and we all know that after absorption all your food material all the digested food material will first come to liver and how is that coming to liver from your intestines after absorption is via portal vein okay we have studied this in our anatomy part don't worry about that so whatever food materials that has been digested the second thing that is going to happen is absorption ab hoga absorption so all that glucose and fructose and galactose everything will be absorbed and first that glucose fructose and galactose will be yes taken to liver theek hai sir so i'm telling you from the scratch guys it's not like biochemistry start karte hai you know we are going to study about glycolysis krebs cycle and all those things biochemistry is not about only the reactions or pathways something like that it's a wrong thing the uh, i'm going to start from the scratch so please try to take the advantage of that and learn that properly so i'm consuming food that is digested i'm getting glucose fructose galactose and that is being absorbed and after absorption it is going to my first liver Now, guys, why it is going to liver first of all, sir? Why? Because sometimes if we eat more, sometimes, yeah, many times whenever you are going to parties and all, because you don't have to pay the bill, you eat like hell, है ना? पता चला किसी का पार्टी है, किसी का शादी है, है ना? किसी का फंक्शन है, वहाँ पर जाके right from very beginning, starter, main course, oh, dessert, इतना खाते, इतना खाते, 
and right now we all know that after eating so much from digestion will happen large amount of glucose will be formed if that large amount of glucose directly comes into my blood my blood glucose level will go up that's very bad that is why god has done one thing first of all the digested food will come to liver acha in the liver what is going to happen that will be stored lekin yahan par ek chota sa panga there is a small problem the problem is that glucose cannot be stored in the form of glucose it will be converted to glycogen oh oh so glucose will not be stored in the form of glucose guys glucose will now get converted in the form of glycogen can anyone tell me what is the name of the pathway converting the glucose to glycogen glucose is getting converted to glycogen by which pathway tell me the name of the pathway okay yes very good very good see learn with meaning guys we are actually forming what here sir glycogen so therefore the name of the pathway here will be glycogenesis okay so what is the name of the pathway here sir it's actually glycogen and we are actually forming glycogen genesis ka matlab hota hai synthesis generation forming forming glycogen wow so remember from today onwards glycogenesis meaning se padhiye sir glycogen okay and genesis means formation of glycogen guys and acha uh, why, why is this glycogen forming we all know why because yes uh, glucose cannot be stored in the form of glucose the glucose has to be stored in the form of what's a glycogen so it will be stored in the form of glycogen okay now once you are done with this one here right now the next thing is whenever required this glycogen will break down here and this glycogen will again break down back to glucose this glycogen will again break down back to glucose okay and because it is breaking down guys the name of this pathway will be actually glycogenolysis glycogenolysis what is the meaning of glycogenolysis sir so it is glycogen and lysis is actually break down so break down of glycogen is glycogenolysis okay find with that are you okay with that 